we're Jason and Josh and today we head back to Wingham Wildlife Park as we invite you to join us to explore their brand new bug garden. And despite the outrageous British weather, we still have an amazing day seeing lots of different animals. Come along and join the adventure. Good morning everybody and welcome back to a new daily vlog. We are off to the zoo today. Yay! And of course the weather's not on our side. No, we're going to Wingham Wildlife Park. We're going to get some use out of our annual passes. Yes, Every single time we go to Wingham, it rains. Every single time. And it doesn't look like today is going to be any exception. It's not raining right this second, but it has been. But we've got um, umbrellas packed, so... We're prepared. We're prepared. Um, also, they've got a new section. Yes. Um, I can't remember exactly what it is. It's I don't just, know, it's, it's sort of bugs. Or something. Some sort of bugs. We saw it being built last time we was there. It was like, oh, what's that? And then a week later they opened it, so... And also... The indoor sections are now open, which weren't open when yeah, we went so we'll last time. Yeah, so we'll take you guys in to see some reptiles. The tropical house. The tropical house. And also, we should be able to see the um, chimpanzees today, because you couldn't go onto yes. the inside bit, and last time they were all hiding from the rain. Yes. So that's going to be really exciting. It's crazy. Every time we go, something different has changed. So like last time we couldn't go inside, yeah. now we can go inside. So next time we go, we don't think we'll be wearing masks. You'll so. be able to kidnap a penguin. No. Oh, OK. Wing and Wildlife Park. Of course it's <gasps> raining. It's always raining. The car park looks empty. Look at the car park. Well empty. At least we should see oh, the man. otters. That's true. They always come out when it's wet. Let's go up here for a change. Oh, this is different. I know, oh, right? Really different. Well, we'll throw you off. We want to park further down in the car park because our tyre light has flashed. So obviously we want to fill up with air later. We're going to make a lot of noise. We don't want everyone looking at us. So parking on the other end. Looks like because of the weather it's going to be nice and quiet there. Yeah, good. So we've come through, we were going to go in the reptile house, but it's closed and they've knocked all this down. And they're building something new. And they're building new. something new, which is good. It's exciting. It is, but I'm quite gutted. I wanted to go in there. Well, we can still go in the tropical house though, because it's yeah. over there. Well, we head over to the tropical house, but I really want to know what this is going to be. We need to uh, investigate. investigate. If like, you know what they're going to build, comment down below, let us know. Uh, like we fun. always say, I wish they leave signs to say what they're actually building. Well, because we know they're doing some work at the back of the zoo as well. Yeah. So we don't know what's going in there either, but um, it's exciting that they're they're building new yeah. stuff despite the challenges they've had. I like and They're it. also draining the otter enclosure, which yeah, is... Yeah, how ironic is it that I said at least we'll see the otters today because it's raining. And, and now we won't. We won't because... <laughs> oh, the reptile house <laughs> and pet village are currently closed for refurbishment. So maybe it's just going to be a... Hmm. Maybe they're extending it. Maybe. How long has it been since we last came in here? Oh, like... Yeah. Oh, oh God! Like that. Here we go. Yeah, yeah. Any place we're gonna find it. The bats are still shut. So we still can't go in the bats. Any place we're gonna find any semblance of summer today? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's warm. It's oh, it's noisy. It's just wet. Oh. Listen to them all. Cheap, cheap. Oh. I can't even see. Oh, there's one at the door. Where? Right behind the bird so Oh yeah. Colourful. I see you. Hi. This little guy's trying to help the lady <laughs> clean. <laughs> I will do it like this for you. Oh. <laughs> it's literally birds flying everywhere. You have to uh, keep your wits about you. They see you up there. They see you. It's when you turn your back though and all of a sudden they come flying over your head. It's like, oh, hello. hello. <laughs> Hi friends! You having some breakfast? Oh nice! What you got? Anything nice? Oh, some Instagram. Oh god, look how many of them are up there! This is like a coffee morning going on up here. Look! Oh my god! I don't think I've ever seen that many colourful birds all in one place. That is incredible. They've obviously just been fed. <laughs> I was just recording a slow-mo shot and something spooked them and they all come flying towards us. I was like, ah! Oh! I hope you enjoyed that montage. Give this video a big like if you like that montage. Oh, I was trying my best to hold the camera still whilst not being like speared by a bird. <laughs> they normally have butterflies in here, but 
Yeah, they there. haven't had any in here for a little while now, but hopefully very soon they will be able to bring them back. It does look like a banana palm, yeah. We have a red panda braving the rain. It's funny because he's kind of using the tree the same as we're using the umbrellas. Also, Josh bought the smallest umbrella he could possibly find. So tiny. <laughs> I don't think you're going to be wanting an ice cream today. Nah, I'm really craving jacket potato. And I remember last time we came here with Mum and Sharon and that we had a jacket potato, so... Yeah, they do them in the big cafe, I think. Yeah. Near the penguins! Like, um, tuna one. You can't eat tuna near penguins without giving them some. Baked beans, then. Oh no, that's not a good idea with you around. Oh, it is. Oh, it is. <laughs> we'll have monkeys falling out of trees and all sorts. <laughs> Coming to see the chimps because we didn't get to see them last time. He's got the right idea. He has got the right idea. Oh, look at you. He looks so comfy. I'm so with you on that, man. <laughs> Better than being out in the rain. He's probably just thinking, why are all these people staring at me? No, look sure at that one hanging up there. Oh, look, he's comforting himself. Look at that one hanging up there, look. Where am I looking? Right at the top. Oh, hello. <laughs> a flurry, man. What's he called? Oh. I mean, I think he's good. He's a chimp. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Where's he going? So we found the new bug garden. That giant scorpion's moving. Oh my god. What, well, they're not all that big? Oh, do you know what it feels like? It's, it, make, it makes you feel like you've been shrunk down to the size of a bug. Oh, this is cool. I like it. I like the idea. How cool is this? We've got a worm. It's really nicely planted up though, look at all this. I guess this is, um, I don't think they've actually got bugs in here. I think this is a garden that's been planted to attract the bugs. Yeah, Hopefully, whatever they're eating, they're not gonna get that big. <laughs> this is so cool, look, you can see the worm going through the dirt there. We've got a slug. I've never seen a slug that big. And a snail. Look at the size of this ant mound! This is cool, I like this. Oh my god, look at the size of those two stag beetles. They're enormous. There's butterflies in here, look at this guy. I don't know who this guy is. He obviously works here, he's got Wingham Wildlife Park on his shirt. You alright mate? He's, he's not very talkative. He's not, but I want a selfie with him. <laughs> you want, oh, go on then, get yourself a selfie in there, go on. We need to find out his name, he's not got a name. What's your name, mate? Claw. Dear God. What is that? Is that a maggot? What is that? This is cool, I like it. The size of them stag beetles. I'm glad they're not that big in real life. We've had a couple in the garden recently <laughs> flying around. They were bad enough as they come towards you. It's like, oh my god! Imagine one of them coming towards you. And oh, is there actually going to be ants in here? Got hair things on them. Look. Oh yeah, they've got hair effects on them. Oh, that's cool. That's a soldier ant, look. I soldier boy, I feel it. Oh. This land goes all the way over there as well. Oh my god, yeah, there's more over there. I'm wondering if there's going to be something in this bit. Maybe. Should we find out? Let's go in the uh, poo Let me uh, de-umbrella myself. Ooh. Is there something in there? Oh my god, I can't get in. Oh, it's dark. Oh, what's this? Oh, this is a bit trippy on the camera. I don't really know what this is, but it's something. How are you feeling, Josh? That is a big tarantula. <laughs> oh dear, imagine when... Oh look, there's a bug hotel. What? Oh. That is literally the thing of your worst nightmares. Oh, okay. No, there it is. Oh. <laughs> You're not going to sleep tonight, are you? Do you want a picture with it? <laughs> uh, yeah, why not? Oh, so it look. Must be 
wandered around. Somewhere. They've put a hedgehog house here. We don't know if there's actually a hedgehog or whether it's just to try and encourage them. But I'm assuming we can go up here. This leads cool. somewhere. That leads back into the chimp bit, but we don't want to go up there because oh, no, we want right, to see this so bit. That's the other bit. Okay. Yeah. We want to see what the, I mean. This is that's an earwig, isn't it? I'm not oh. used to seeing these kinds of bugs like this big to see them in this level of detail. Oh look, it reminds me of Bugs Life. These? Oof. Oh, how cool are they? These bees, they look a bit wet. They, look they are a bit wet, but bless them, but a bit fluffy, I guess that's how a bee would be in the rain. Would be. <laughs> anyway, moving on <laughs> swiftly. Oh look, there's a bee hotel. Oh, this is so cool. I'm loving this. It's nice. Be a nice place to come and sit on a sunny day. I'm not going to uh, sit on it today, but. So this thing, oh, it looks like they are. It looks like you're going to say it's nice to have things growing up. Yeah, over, they're going to train like them over. Style. Yeah, it is brand new. It hasn't long opened, yeah. so. Yeah, they're training it. Though. But this is cool. I don't know if it's a clematis or a passion flower. They're going to. Look at this. Caterfly. Caterflies. <laughs> Caterpillars, moths. What's that down there? Some little tower. That's like for a mini Rapunzel. Oh, this is cool. It's so fresh and bright and I know that they've actually, you, I don't know if it's coming out on the camera, but like that's actually fur on there, like a fur effect. It's obviously at the moment because it's raining, it's a bit wet. Oh, I didn't even notice all the bat boxes. Look, wow. they're all the way along the back. This is a really nice use of this space, like, They've made it a, a really nice attraction to come and look at all these bright, fresh, massive bugs, learn about the bugs, but they've actually put stuff in here to try and encourage wildlife in as well. Like, they've planted plants to attract the butterflies and the bees and things to attract the ants, bats, bit, bug hotels, bees, all sorts. It's, this is really cool. So there is actually bugs. There's a building just right at the end that you can come and look in. We thought we um, were done. <laughs> we thought we were done, but we're not. But there's all sorts of things in here, and there's all got, also got some fish tanks, but I don't really know if there's anything in them just yet. Sort of Can't. Oh, I found the mantis. Yeah. He's right there, hanging off of that leaf. Oh, yes. Just about seeing. I don't know if you can see that. He's oh, just no, well. I think there's two of them actually. One's on the back of the other one. One's up here as well, look. Oh, okay. I don't think it's going to focus. I've never seen a domino um, cockroach, by the way. Have you ever seen a domino cockroach? No, I'm too busy looking for scorpions. <laughs> I can't show the spider, he looks really scary, but you can't see him. Oh, God, no. Oh. <laughs> No. It's a tractor millipede. That is making it itch. Also, they've got a green chilli in there, so even they like spicy food. No. <laughs> oh, there's quite a few in here. There's one at the back. Two at the back. Do you think that's there. making your itch? What about an ant collar then? Nope. We're so impressed with that new area. I really, really enjoyed that. I really that. enjoyed that. It's a really nice addition. It's something a little bit different. Rather than just having like a few things with bugs in it, to have oh, all of that yeah. build up to that crescendo. Also, what you couldn't see, there was this enormous tarantula Ooh. it got goosebumps it was horrible Ooh, i was no. like finally go yeah. as you can see it's still absolutely torrentially pouring it down with rain so tarantula it's... pouring it down yes. tarantula pouring it tarantula pouring it yeah let's go see the penguins <laughs> we're gonna go see the penguins i can smell lunch as well by the way is it nearly lunch time yeah, we both no. haven't eaten yet either nope so maybe food after yeah oh my favorite why is it every time we come here we get to the penguins there's always a human in there so i can't put one in my backpack because we know you're coming mm. security measure <laughs> she's down there cleaning the stone she's watching me i can feel her <laughs> she knows my plan Hello. also every time we come there's always one up here looking out of this glass oh Right on cue. Good lad. <laughs> I was literally about to say, he's always up here looking out of this glass. I wonder if it's the same one. <laughs> that was lovely. Thanks for the show. Appreciate it. No shame whatsoever. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have got the right idea, I think. It's quite cosy. It does look quite cosy. It smells quite cosy. No, it doesn't smell great, does it? Oh, that's pretty strong. <laughs> 
these guys aren't bothered by the rain. Kind of poo. Oh, what is it with animals doing a poo every time we get up to them? That's what I was like. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> that's it. That's all you've got for it. You're just going to do a poo and Shake. nothing else. Okay. Now you're having a wee. <laughs> Our timing is impeccable today. Like. <laughs> This is the other new bit they're working on. None of this fence was here before though. This bit was all open. The only problem now is though, this area seems really dark. It does, but then it's summer and all the trees are in leaf as well, so. Yeah, I suppose. Well, yeah. summer. It's exciting though that they're building stuff. Like, I can't wait to see what all of this is gonna be. Hopefully it's gonna be a giant outdoor playground for adults. Ugh. <laughs> yes. We've come inside the cafe. Where it's dry. Where it's dry. For some lunch. For some chips. <laughs> Josh has got, yeah, cheeseburger and chips. I've gone for a plain burger, but I've got salad in my burger. Bit of healthiness. <laughs> yeah, we're going to tuck into this in the dry bit. I think that the rain is starting to ease a little bit. It's brightening up a little bit. So hopefully we've over the worst of it. Having said that, though, despite the rain, there's a lot of animals out. You know, we're seeing a lot of animals still. I'm quite impressed. They're, they're hardcore, the animals here at Wingham. Hardcore. We've had our lunch. This new area is definitely going to be a playground. Don't hold out much hope for it being for adults though, but I have just noticed there's a sign. Oh, there's actually a sign. It says specialised sports products and supreme golf oh. working in conjunction with Wingham Wildlife. Is there going to be a crazy golf course coming to Wingham after? That would be amazing. Oh. <laughs> That would be cool though. We literally went to Blue Water last night to play crazy golf if you haven't seen that video. Yeah, and it's so much fun. Better. So, you know, if we can come in here, see a load of animals, do the bug garden and everything, and play crazy golf, I'm sold. But is it going to be extra? Who cares? It's fun. Oh. <laughs> oh, look at him, look, 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 look at that one. Where, where? Oh, he's just poking out. Mm. Peekaboo! Oh, he just stuck his tongue out. That's so cute. I want one. Oh, look. I think we can fit one of them in the bag and we can fit a penguin in the bag. Okay. But I don't think these... He looks He looks like how I feel about the current state of the British summer. Two bears are just chilling. There's another one backing and forth filling the uh, inside closure. Yeah, he, he gets to the bit where he comes out the door and he's like, nope. Too wet. Too wet, not going out there. But these two are just like, nah. Gonna lay in it. Oh my god, there's tiny horses. I feel like we're in the new forest again. Oh. Whoa. Okay. I was, really? I was just doing a little bit of a song for the horses to the tune of Alton John's Tiny Dancer and you went full on cabaret. Anyway. Hi. How cute are they? There is music going on over there. Maybe the orangutans are having a party because the orangutans are just behind these guys. Music was the uh, TV. <laughs> They're not having a party. We are though. Oh. It's very soothing. We're just heading down to look at the uh, orangutans. Looks like their grass has just been well trimmed. They were well, hiding under their blankets. Oh, they, they're time. normally under their blankets. Maybe we'll go to the next one. The good thing is if they're inside this time, we can go inside too. Yes. <laughs> Getting a bit of a summer vibe. Is that yes. got palm trees on it? I'm trying to work out if it's a blanket or a beach towel. It's a blanket, but it looks like a beach towel. Yeah. There's another blanket there as well. Oh, look, yeah. there he is. He's down there. Let's, Where is Let's go down there. He's swimming. Ooh, oh, Let's go down. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, they're both broken glasses. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go to this one. Hello. Oh, no. Just keep swinging. Just keep swinging. Mm. Oh, he's gorgeous. He is lovely. You don't normally get... Did you hear that? I think you don't... it's a monkey up there. <laughs> He's gone round to the front now. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> I always love it here with these enclosures. Yeah. Big out bush They've got this massive tunnel. Yeah, look at this tunnel. They can they go, go along this tunnel. Over the dinosaurs. Up here. <laughs> and then back into the building we're about to go into. Well, hopefully we're going to see some giraffes. Hopefully. <laughs> got fresh branches. They're happy. They're happy. Well, these guys are having a feast. Feast, feast, feast. 
They are at a feast. They weren't truly really tucking into that branch. See when they've like gnawed down the stem. Yeah, the, the actual bark of the wood, yeah. Well, despite the rain, we had another fantastic day at Wingham Wildlife Park. We do love it there. That's why we bought our season passes. And the new bug garden was absolutely brilliant. It really, really blew us away. We was not expecting that at all. I didn't see a scorpion in the end, though. We'll have to try next time, but it was great fun. So if you're thinking of going to Wingham, definitely go and check out the new bug garden. We will see you tomorrow for another daily vlog. Stay safe, everybody. Take care. See you soon.